Hello and greetings. Uh, you join me once again in the land of Goddess. Uh, there's been a few developments, I guess you could say. Um, not sure what the shrine is yet. That's what I was leaving until I started recording this one, so that you can join me in the unveiling. And as I've said before, I will be having a go at the Voyage of Discovery! Uh, but for now, uh, as you can see that as well, I've got more abodes. There are a few more around here because obviously there's a, a big space there which I will hopefully get round to developing soon when I need more population. Speaking of more population, I happen to have reached another milestone, which is now the farming settlement. I will not well, I was about that then. All about in radius bounds, breeder capacity plus 40%, worker capacity plus 10% worker type farmers. Farming settlements can assign farmers who build fields on plots. They will work in the fields and return wheat to the settlement for collection. So obviously that will uh, require some unlocking. Oh! Hello. I appear to have unlocked a mud lodge. Uh, what's that? A size 3 about? Okay, uh, four breeders, one worker, belief per hour, belief capacity, blah, 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 blah. builder about those more followers, generate more belief, blah, blah, blah. Uh, any more for any more? No? Is that it? Just those two? Because I kind of did give, get a big boost, well, I say big boost, a bit of a boost in uh, population. <coughs> And due to having a few more abodes just there, um, I don't know if I think I had that one before. Uh, oh, uh, a couple more down here. There's what that one there and this one, and and obviously these uh, few here. Which so anyway, let us find out what this shrine is for. <gasps> the finger of God. Mm. Okay, power details. Cost five hundred. Duration ten seconds. Follower squish. About deconstruct tree fire. Click to directly interact with your world. Squish followers. Destroy abodes. Satellite trees and smash rocks. Right. Okay. That will come in handy, actually, because some of the uh, older abodes, such as these that <laughs> these that I included in the settlement, which I should have really um, in fact, what the, have I clicked on something? Oh, of course, I clicked on the the shrine. Uh, the info on the shrine is that is shrine repaired. The, oh, temple description goes here. Yeah, I don't think it does because it's not a temple, it's just a shrine. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so anyway. Um, yeah, I, I kind of do wish I'd put that the settlement down here really to include these abouts instead of the, uh, the old ones. Uh, I've still got unemployed people here because I don't appear to be able to build any more abodes inside the settlement where I, you know, I could easily uh, fit a few more in there. Alright, let's uh, just see what we have. Um, right, there's that, 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 that. That still is being rather elusive. So, right. Um, ah, there's the mud lodge. Um, 
Right, what, what stickers have I got? Uh, I've got five of those, and it looks like but just one animal fur. Now, if that's going to be the same as before, where you need about seven stickers just to unlock something, then yeah. Um. Oh. What? What the heck happened there? Uh. For some reason, I, I couldn't uh, click anything. So, well, I'm going to leave that for now. The farming settlement one. Obviously, I'm going to try and just do the cards in order, so that I don't get ahead of myself. Um, and so, uh, but in fact, I think I might leave that anyway because I don't really need that. Uh, I'm, uh, well, let's see. Anyway, let's just. Uh, yeah, that's going to take about seven, and yeah, that's pretty much the same. Which is a bit ridiculous, I mean, you know, okay, yeah, it's understandable that you're going to need, like, some stickers, but really, you know, to, re to require so many just for one card. It's kind of a bit ridiculous, and especially something so early on. You know, it's not as if it's uh, kind of way up here somewhere, you know, in the, this Bronze Age. You know what I mean? We're not even in the Bronze Age just yet. We're still in the Primitive Age. I mean, I, I guess you could say I've just broke into the Bronze Age with the Mud Lodge. But we're not actually quite there yet. So, it, you know, it would be nice if, uh Right, well, it, is that... Oh, I don't even need to stick it on. I can see at the, the bottom of the... The bottom left of the card there, that... That's going to need a lot of stickers. But, that does give us... A, a reason, I guess you could say... For trying out this... Voyage of Discovery. Now, let's click Go. Now then. As you can see, oh, time left is unlimited on this one because it's it's kind of a, a first thing. Uh, th this is going to be the first one. What I realised, what uh, somebody had mentioned um, in like a review of Goddess on Steam, they were saying this. Right, okay, uh, sound seems to be back to normal. Uh, so, I kind of like didn't do anything because uh, what I was saying is this is like the new kind of multiplayer thing where, where you had to battle people before and you were rewarded with like resources and whatever. This is the new thing, so. Uh, as you can see there, ship of your followers, that 
let's kind of look there. And this is our first destination. So if we click there and here we go. Now what I need oh, I've been rewarded with a new sticker. Basically what I need to do is get the people from the ship uh, it, 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 it's kind of like well, I think somebody said it's like lemmings um, all, all I need to do is just get people to there so if I click land uh, five followers must, must reach the temple right Oh, um, yeah, I, I want to do, do it, please. Yeah, I know I've been rewarded a new sticker. I would like to, uh, do the task. Land, yeah. <laughs> this is it. Well, I mean, obviously, it's uh, obviously it's going to start easy. And uh Hmm. Okay. So uh yeah, it's okay, the same was going funny again. Uh, as you probably saw there. Uh, according to that, I lost. Uh, I lost twenty-three of my people, and I'm guessing by the, every time it's reinforced, that probably means. Yeah. Uh, I don't know why that's doing that. But anyway, let's uh, return to civilization. Um, well, that didn't make much sense. Uh, you're saying that I lost 23 people. How? I do not know. Right. <clears throat> Tap and see lost follower. Yeah, thanks to not being able to turn the camera, I cannot see lost any lost follower. And I'm not going to waste any resources. Oh, is that in there? 
Is it still lost there? What an idiot. I actually moved the land. Because it, it, it was lost before. I actually moved it. The idiot climbed back up somehow. And now he's lost again. This is just stupid, actually. <laughs> oh, dear. So anyway, yeah, that was, uh, that was my first voyage, which I'm a little bit baffled because I don't quite understand um, how it managed to lose that many uh, that many people. Can I, let, let's see if I can do something. Lost Right, okay, I have no idea why the, the, the sound sort of goes all and to be honest, it, it's not just like the, the mic sound, it's the actual game sound as well. Right, so let me click on there. God powers, ah, there we go. Finger of God. So if I click that... Means I can Wow. Uh, <laughs> right, the builders uh I mean, come on, really, should I need to even do that? Right, they're going to run back in there. Uh, well, that was helpful, wasn't it? Thank you, builders, for nothing. Well, how silly was that? Right, I've just got rid of a couple of the belts because I want to rebuild. And... Oh, right. Let's click on there. Oh, right. They're not exactly builders. They're just... They're actually some of the um, unemployed, I think. Uh, yeah. I don't think I've quite got the hang of how settlements work. Um, I was kind of hoping that... Uh, <laughs> the way that would work is similar to outside of settlements where if I destroyed an about I would just click on an, another about where there's a builder and they would come and build another one. Uh, 
Um, there's another lost follower. Oh, is he that idiot who keeps climbing up here? Yeah. Seriously, I have no idea how this guy got all the way up here. Honestly. idiot. Get over there. What the fuck? Seriously, man. Where are you going? No, don't climb higher, you f dickhead. Go there. Good grief. How stupid are you? See, this is <laughs> this is just how infuriating the game is. You've got idiots like that. Uh, these guys suddenly don't want to build anymore. I mean, the, the, the complete and utter baffling thing is, is how we got up there in the first place? I honestly do not know how we managed to get up there, because there's no possible way. But now what it keeps doing is running backwards and forwards. And it's not letting me... Uh. You know, I mean, I'm doing that. I want him to go there. But there's plenty of opportunity. There's lots of space. But will he? No. Lost him. Lost him.
Oh. Hooray. Uh, I've no idea why, but I, I've apparently set fire to uh, all these trees. The reason I say no idea why is because when I was using the god figure, it was all over here. So, why these trees decided to set fire, I have no idea. Looks like just completely baffled. Um, so, yeah. Also, I don't know why I keep getting a, a lot of the. Uh, but the slowdown and disruption, uh, as I was saying, like the old. <laughs> I don't know why it does that. I mean, possibly a lack of sources. I know that, I mean, God does just use around one and a half gigabytes of memory. But, I, I have got enough. I mean, the, although it's like a laptop, it's got four gigabytes. And I usually have at least two gigabytes free. You know what I mean? I, I'm only using... The, the, the system's only using something like... I checked the resor resources the other day. And... With pretty much barely nothing running... Or barely anything running, I should say. Uh, I was using something like 800 megabytes of RAM. Now... That leaves me with a clear 2 gigabytes. But for some reason, uh, maybe not. I mean, I do have obviously Bandicam and Audacity running. I, I use Audacity to, re to record me speaking and Bandicam to record the game. Um, but yeah, not sure why it does it. Oh, and obviously, I've got Steam running because. Uh, Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to play Goddess. 